Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Earlier today, I let you know that Edge had just got a new tab groups button for the bookmarks bar. And I showed you how you can actually remove this. I'll link the video down below and in the end screen. Now, something else that's been noted is it also, as I mentioned, places a tab groups entry into the main menu or the three dotted menu. And this cannot be removed or turned off. Only the tab groups in the bookmarks bar can be removed. Now, unfortunately, though, this has brought a bit of a small significant change, maybe in the wrong direction, to this main menu or the ellipsis menu, as it's also known. Where now you can see that everything doesn't fit on the screen. So help and feedback and close edge are cut off. So if you look at that again, you can see, which was previously not the case. So this entry now has pushed everything down. Now, it's not a big deal because if you're on a desktop or a larger laptop, you'll have a bigger screen. But if you're running like a 15, 16 inch, as in my case, you're going to have to scroll down to get to a couple of these last entries now um, to select maybe settings, help feedback, close Microsoft Edge. Now, this isn't such a big deal, as mentioned, but the problem with this is that a year or so ago, as I posted, Microsoft went to lengths to de-bloat this main menu. And now it seems that Microsoft has come full circle because now all the different listings and entries cannot fit on the screen. And part of the reason for this is because, as I posted a little while back, the performance toggle was split into performance and secure network where this was all combined and that also added an extra entry and now we've got an extra entry so things are getting bloated again so scratching my head once again because microsoft went to lengths to debloat it they even moved a lot of the entries out of the main menu into the overflow more tools menu but now it seems microsoft has come full circle once again and that main menu is getting bloated once again which is a pity because I actually liked being able to just have the menu that wasn't so cluttered fitting on my screen, which no longer is the case. So full circle as mentioned. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.